Hi everyone, I'm Ashley Bornanson here in Hollywood with the Red Carpet Report. We're at the Stars for Stripes charity benefit, promoting the rescue of wild tigers, hosted by Allison Eastwood and Katie Cleary. Hashtag rawr. I'm Ashley with the Red Carpet Report. How you doing? Nice to meet you again. Good. Mind if we ask you a couple questions? No, no, no. All right, so I saw some of your paintings in there, and they are gorgeous. Can you Thank tell me you. how you got involved? Yeah, um, I'm actually friends with Katie, you know, she does all these, and she did the Diamonds Not For One last year, and I had a painting on display there, so she asked me if I could do one for it this year, and at first I was like, I don't know, I don't have time, like, it just so happened that I had a painting that worked last year, but last minute I was like, no, you know, I really care about the tigers, and that's all I want to do with my art is be able to save the animals anyways. So I made myself do it, and now I'm really happy I did. So Now you're saying, you know, I might not have enough time. How much time did it take you to make those paintings? Because they're pretty elaborate. Yeah, 71 hours it took for the Tiger one. Wow. <laughs> yeah, and the thing is, I'm like, oh, I wish I had like another 70, because I could do so much more. I feel like, I mean, I'm sure, I don't know if it would look that much different to everybody else, but to me it's like, oh, there's this line I could fix. And you know. <laughs> Only you would notice. Uh, yeah, probably. So. And you said a lot of your paintings are to support animals. Mm -hmm. Well, it's kind of turned into that. I mean, I have a lot of paintings about different things, but most recently it's been all about animals, which is crazy. I don't even know how this happened, but <laughs> I'm looking back and it's a lot of animals, but it's good. People love it. So. Can you tell me why tigers specifically are on your heart? Well, I did the tigers obviously for this, for Stars for Stripes, but um, People don't realize how big of a problem it is. Like, the in the last century, the elephant population has dropped 50%, but the tiger population has dropped 95%. That's crazy. Wow. So that's why. I mean, it's just absolutely absurd. I can't believe that we're letting stuff happen like this. You know. So, and it's just a matter of people being ignorant. Well, shouldn't be anymore. I mean, you need to do something about it. You know. So. And you do great of using art to support activism as well. Yeah. These people look at art, they ask you about it, and then they're not, you're not gonna, if I was to stand on the side of a road and say, hey, you should save the tigers, no one would care. Mm -hmm. But they'll be like, oh, that's such a pretty painting. I'm like, oh, you think so? Well, it doesn't happen in the wild anymore because blah, 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 you know, and then people are interested a little bit more. What was your inspiration when you were making these paintings? Um, I don't know, I, honestly, the animals, as simple as that sounds, I mean, that's why I'm doing it, you know. Sometimes you're like, oh, I don't wanna paint this anymore. <laughs> they're kind of hard, but. Mm -hmm worth the challenge and it's always really rewarding at the end. Wow, so where can we see more of your art? Um, my website will keep everything up to date. I'm going to have a big show in a year or less. I have no idea where or what yet, whenever my work is done. So Sounds good. And keep up to date with me on there. Okay, and can you give us your Twitter handle so we can catch up with you on Twitter? Yeah, it's just at Darcy Odom. It's really at simple. Darcy Odom. Yep. Okay, sounds good. Thank you, Thank you. Thanks for watching. For more exclusive interviews, like us, favorite, and subscribe.